according to OSHA, a confined space is any work, any space that is uh, A, large enough to enter and perform work, B, uh, has limited uh, means of access and egress, uh, and C, it's not designed for continuous occupancy. Well, my name is Jim Thone. Um, I'm the owner and president of Rescue Northwest. I worked with the PUD, um, I think this is about our sixth year. By the time I leave here, their uh, confined space rescue team is um, better trained and able to perform a rescue as far as saving the lives of an injured or uh, sick coworker. This week, of course, we were here at Priest Rapids. Last week was at Wanapum. And each class was a 32 hour uh, confined space rescue class over four days. The average class is somewhere between 8 and 16 students, although we've, we've had classes up to 24. We always start in the classroom covering the fundamentals of what is a confined space. Mostly days two and three are hands on skill stations uh, where we they get used to working with rope systems. coming down horizontal to stay out of the way, guys. Then on day four, uh, it's almost all uh, simulated rescues all day. Oh, yeah, don't, uh, don't rely on that. Don't tighten down there, remember how? Glass is working as a team, and uh, they assign, they're assigned different positions, uh, and they fulfill those positions to, uh, to carry out those roles. And, work as a team to effect a rescue. Take the load. <laughs> 